Hey guys, so I wanted to be sure that I kept uploading while I was out of town. I am out of town for work training. I'll be here for a week, so excuse the hotel bathroom in the background, but I'm going to show you my quick get ready professional looks every day. So we're going to dive in. Today we're going to be using the chocolate bar palette. I brought it with me just because it seemed easy to work with. This is the look. Excuse my ratchet winged liner. Uh, keep watching. Alright, so I'm going to show you my quick look. I got about 20 minutes to get downstairs for my conference. And I'm going to be using the chocolate bar palette. <clears throat> I haven't used it a whole lot, but I have used it a little bit, so I have an idea of what I want to do. So I'm going to go in here, and I'm going to pick up marzipan right there. Well, first I'm going to pick up white chocolate and use that to lay down on my... Okay, then I'm going to pick up marzipan, this slot pan color. And it's just going to go in my crease because it's a nice, pretty transition shade. It's got a teeny bit of shimmer, but that'll be alright. can't really see it a whole lot, but that's okay. So now I'm going to go in with milk chocolate right here. And I'm just going to put that in a little bit tighter in the crease. Maybe it's this brush. It's just not picking anything up. Oh, no. Yeah, it is. Okay. Oh, I always get it down too far. Look right there. I'm going to try to clean that up in a minute, though. <coughs> okay. So I'm just laying this back over in the other eye, too. And that's what it looks like now. I need to get this off, though, so I can cut that corner in a second. Okay. It's not as dark on this left eye, so I'm just going to pack that in a little bit more. Yeah, it's about the same. Okay, so what I want to do now to get this even is I'm going to take this. It's got kind of a tip on it. Oh, and this is the tricky part. Okay, I'm going to take this and I'm going to pick up triple fudge. And since I just learned how to cut crease last week, I want to attempt to do it again today. So I'm going to try, keyword, to put this right where I want to cut out my crease and then smoke it out when I get done. Okay, so I have it where I want to cut this crease, but before I cut it, I want to take a teeny bit of this candy to violet, because I'm wearing purple today, and just pop it over here in this outer corner. See if I can get it to come off better like this and then just blend it around. Yeah, that's better. Okay. So I'm just putting it on my finger, sticking it about where I want it. 
just because I'm in too big of a hurry and I didn't bring any prep fix spray with me. I gotta go get some later. And then just blending it kind of around so that it's a little closer to how I wanted it. Still not quite there though. Okay. So what I'm gonna do now where I cut out that crease soft ochre because of course and I'm just gonna fill that lid in sorry for being out of the camera I'm just filling this in like so, so I can layer the color I want on top of it, which I haven't quite decided what color I want, but we're going to evaluate in a second. Okay, so both of those are covered. Honestly, it looks pretty good with it just covered. I want to be super lazy. I'd just do that, but I have pictures today. I'm just going to use my finger this time. <clears throat> I'm going to see how you... Okay, yeah. I want to go for a smoked out dark look. So I'm going to take this Black Forest Truffle and I'm going to lay it down. Uh, it's not too bad. It can go right in this cut crease. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, so this is turning out way better than I expected. It's got like a reddish tint to it, which I think is going to go perfect for today because I want to look very smoldering and adult look. I'm always the youngest person at all of these things. So I try to mature myself a little so the makeup makes me look old. That's okay. But I think today I might have pulled it off the right way. Okay, so all I need to do now <clears throat> which brush is this? Yeah. I'm gonna take old fluffy here. And I'm gonna go back in with Mars of Hand. It's the shimmery shade, and I'm just gonna throw it up here to kind of blend some stuff out a little bit better. And then I'm gonna take the pointed one, and we're gonna go into semi sweet, I think. Yeah, that's what I wanna try. And we're going to put this up here. And I know this looks horrible, but just bear with me. Put it up here. And take you. And we're just going to do the thing. Try to get it a little bit more smoked out. And I'm noticing the only thing I don't like, but I guess looking at this you would know like I don't feel like I could do anything bright with this because like I tried to put that purple in and it like I mean it was just shimmer with a teeny tiny purple finish. It didn't have any real pigment to it. I think the only one that might is the pink, but I think you would have to lay down like NYX Milk or something to even get that color to show up. But okay, I'm going to pop on some eyeliner, fix my hair, and I'll be right back for the final All look. Right. So here is the final look. I got my hair straightened. Yes, for once in my life, I did my hair. And I have this eyeliner. I went ahead and popped a little bit of that shimmer into the inner corner, added some Ofra liquid lip some eyeliner and some better than sex mascara so yeah hope y'all like it comment below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel